offense again. He's had a solid start to this game, but bottom line is they're losing, so he, he doesn't care about his stats. He just wants to right the ship on the scoreboard. He wants to actually increase his stats because he feels like if he does, that means things will get better for his team, maybe get him back into the ball game or into the lead. In these situations, I remember playing with a quarterback once where he actually ran out onto the field first ahead of everyone else just to say, guys, let's go. Try and create that energy, create that spark. Well, so far, he has one touchdown, one interception. He'll be looking for that second touchdown now. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. He didn't even try to signal for a timeout, so they must have not been aware of the numbers. I think he lost track of the time left in the Still play clock down. and probably was trying to read the defense and trying to figure out which play to run and just lost track, and it cost him. And now after the delay of game, they're operating behind the stick, second and 15. From the shotgun, Griffin. He's going to find his receiver, Chris Moore. And they work this well upfield across the 45. 25 yards there on the catch and run. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. down with Griffin. That's into the hands of the tight end, Boyle. Griffin's pass. Five yards on the catch there, brings up second down. A gain of five. That's a staple of this offense, drag route to the tight end. Yeah, he's unable to use his size to break off much more yardage after the catch, but still an effective gain nonetheless. Throwing again on second down. Griffin, he's going to look deep for Moore. That's caught inside the 20. It'll go as an impressive 31-yard gain. Raven. First and 10 at the 18-yard line. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. So we have reached halftime in our first preseason matchup of the year. As we'll send you down the coast now to Orlando, that's where we find Jonathan Coachman ready with our EA Sports halftime report. Coach. Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. Back to you guys in just a minute. As we've started the countdown to opening night, three more weeks of preseason action follow this, and then we get it all started. Less than one month from tonight in our game. Most of the starters have made their cameo and departed, but plenty of youngsters out there with a lot to gain or lose as we get you right back out to Brandon God. Probably not likely to see many starters in the second half as we get back at it underway in this preseason opener. And we will not see a return to start the half as this will be a touchback. Out come the Bills now as he'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. We have not seen much on offense from either side these last few drives. It has been a struggle, hasn't it? Totally, and you're thinking to yourself right now, if you're on offense trying to get things figured out, okay, we self-scout every week in our game plan. How many things do we do at certain times? What are our tendencies? Time to go to some of those tendency breakers and try and create some offense. They always have those in their back pocket, don't they? You have to. And if you don't keep abreast of what you're doing, you lock into a rhythm and make it easy for the opposition. Looking for tendency breakers right now. Well, Bart, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play that picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. 
first carry here for Taiwan Jones. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Taking it in from 11 yards out. And the Bills will add on to their lead. A solid blocking up front from the guys on the offensive line allowed him to get in for the touchdown. Yeah, some might say that the guys on the offensive line were in concert. I used to have a coach who called it marrying up, meaning when you get on a guy, you just stay right there, and each guy has his own assignment. That allowed the runner to make the big move towards the end zone. His kick is good. Hauschka with the extra point, and the lead is up to eight. That drive started on their own 25. Two plays, 75 yards later, into the end zone. Hauschka now to send this one away following the score. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And they'll get him down right at the 25-yard line, so the same result.